a lot of things are on the counter right now because a lot of this is new um i'm gonna organize all this not what it's gonna look like obviously i did just get this little dish tray a little toothbrush holder i also got this little peony vase right there but hold on let me get, just get started with organization so my stuff is like scattered all over the place right now like i need to organize and this is what's causing me a lot of stress because my stuff is just everywhere this is some sas stuff in here and then it's just my stuff is everywhere so what i've done is also for makeup i'm having it's really irritating like going in here and everything's lost so for makeup i did get like this little organization tray so i'm gonna put try and stuff everything in there and then i could just have it down there and then anytime i need to do my makeup i just pull it out and i put it back and then as far as <laughs> I, if you see that stuff it's uh <laughs> i i just realized how random that looked or how bad that looked it's uh these little things to make the toilet smell good it is not anything crazy another cart now i wasn't planning on buying another one of these but i did get this for my apartment as well so that way i can organize all my body care and i won't take up so much space in the bathroom i won't take up closet space storage space like i don't know i just need to organize so i'm gonna go ahead and get this built i am watching big brother so let me go ahead and put it down um, I did literally just wake up. When I went in the bathroom to wash up, I was just like, I need to clean up. And so that's why I just need to organize and clean. I'm gonna go ahead and build this. I built one before, it's fairly fast and easy. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and really quickly build this and I do a time lapse so you guys can. So, if you're a fan of Big Brother, let me know who you're rooting for. Oh, let me turn this down. Let me know who you're rooting for. I'm currently watching the episode where they sent Joseph home. Very well. I do watch live feeds. I kind of save the episodes for like later on to binge watch because I already watch the live feed, so it's like I know what's going on anyway, and I don't like I don't care how they edit it. So I was a huge fan of Joseph. I thought he was very funny. He was playing the middle, which is a dangerous game, but I just enjoyed his like spirit and stuff in the house. Should I put this up here so you guys can see? And of course I love Taylor. have another cart easy to build it's like takes like 15 minutes okay so i stuffed the cart um i'm right now gonna figure out what i want in what level okay originally i prefer the top level to be my body sprays because it's like the easiest to reach however now i do want to put skincare on here since i i, I think what i want to do is skincare perfumes body sprays and then lotions and scrubs i'm assuming just because i do want to have like my sunscreen deodorant anything or face washes like anything immediate i want it to be up here just because so i could do it every day and then i think i'll settle for body sprays down here whoop de doo i'll have to bend over no biggie and then the lotions i'll do down here i think that's what i am aiming for right now i laid everything out and this is what it's looking like not my best work but i tried that's all my facial stuff perfumes uh this is all miscellaneous i'm going to get to in a little hair but let me go through this margarita cupcake gingham heart of gold what is that stress relief in sandal the island edition and sandalwood and eucalyptus which is almost done Honey Wildflower Christmas Cookies, which is almost done. Champagne Sprinkles Energy in Island Edition, which is Plumera and Mandarin, which is almost done. Hemp's almost done. And this Nivea Vanilla with Almond Oil. Down below, I have a Steel, which is almost done. You're the One Golden Clementine and Amber. Cinnamon Donut Swirl sens Sensual Amber. Midsummer Dream. And this Jurgens Skin Smoothie in, what is it, the Grapefruit? Yes. 
below i also have a shea moisture what is it bath body massage oil down below these are my body washes i have the caress shea butter and brown sugar the honey pot the target up and up body wash the ogx coconut coffee christmas cookies gingham heart of gold pastel skies joy sugar snickerdoodle another christmas cookies graphite which is almost done down below i have this body ecology coconut hibiscus i have a couple bars of soaps here like this bag i don't like them it dries out your skin incredibly uh this is a bubble bath and a thousand wishes black raspberry vanilla sunrise woods cleansing body mousse cinnamon donut swirl coconut candy apple and vanilla mocha two scrubs over here one in japanese cherry blossom and a vitamin c these are the scents i have in this apartment so far pink watermelon you are the one midsummer dream sunrise woods sweater weather gingham heart of gold pastel skies cloud nine fireside flurries happy vibes vanilla mocha cream honey wildflower victoria's secrets press snow soft and dreamy and victoria's secret bombshell in bloom now as i'm looking through this there's a lot in here i don't like and there's a lot in here that are almost empty so i do need to replenish this first of all sweater weather i never use this never going to use it so i'm going to take this one out i am sick of gingham heart of gold i have so many backups backups of this i wore my, i love this scent but i wore it out so i am going to exchange this this one is still brand new sunrise woods i love this scent but i don't use it like it's still brand new i'm going to exchange this out and then these i do love these um you're the one i don't wear anymore but i'm going to keep pink watermelon i'm going to go ahead and keep so for these three i'm going to take it to the store and get out a new fall scent fireside flurries i like actually this one i sprayed it on yesterday and my boyfriend's like is something burning in there i was like oh um no it's just me <laughs> smelling like a campfire happy vibes i'm not gonna wear this much longer but i'm not gonna exchange it because it's like down here so i'm just gonna try and tough it out vanilla mocha cream honey wildflower i think i'm gonna is that enough the policy is like 50 percent or something but i feel awkward exchanging it if i used it but i'm not gonna wear this anymore so i think i'm gonna put it to the side for now or because i want it decluttered out of here so i'm just gonna put it aside I don't remember what this smells like. I love this. I love this. But I'm just going to keep it because I need variety in my scents. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on the second shelf. So for now, that is what it looks like. I think, again, I'm going to go ahead and exchange this one with the thing. I'm definitely, uh, what should I do? This is also new. I do love this scent, but what happened is I bought so much of it and I, I tired, I wore myself out. The packaging is cute though. I'll leave it for now. I'm definitely not gonna wear champagne sprinkles. And see, these are all almost done, so there's not even a point. Ugh. Actually, I feel like these are gonna go on my empties pretty soon. Dang, I need to stock up on my body creams. I don't think I'm gonna wear this, but whatever. That's almost done. Wow, my collection. See, this is. I need to ship out more things from my other house and bring them to my apartment because you would look at this and not even know I have over a hundred at the other location. But for now, I'm gonna go ahead and add this to the second row. I don't think I'm gonna declutter anything from here. Um, you know, shower gels go by pretty quick and the scents I'm not too picky with shower gels, so I'm just gonna put all this in there. Okay, I'm gonna put scrubs at the bottom. I'm gonna put bar soaps at the bottom. This is not my finest organization work, but it will do until I get my collection over here. What I actually really need to do is take out all these empty ones and find a project to use it up so it doesn't take up space in here. And I'm also gonna put hair stuff in the bottom. I have 
a dry shampoo, have aromatherapy, shower steamers, just like I'm putting more miscellaneous things at the bottom. I have this, but my boyfriend told me to throw it away. He said it's for his hair, but uh, I don't know. I guess his hair person told them to not use Cantu, so I'm throwing this away. This is what the bottom is looking like. I have a lot of space. Now I'm gonna do the top really quick, which is perfumes. Well, this top layer, I like I said, I'm gonna put perfumes and everyday stuff, kind of like gel, uh, like face cleanser, sunscreen, deodorant, uh, face washes, more like everyday stuff I wanna put up here. So this is just a Versace Dylan Turquoise uh, perfume I got. Looks like this oh she is beautiful it says like versace over here she is a beauty queen this is the fairy tale i got from sas okay, she looks like that i have an ariana grande cloud i have three dossier Aqu aquatic peony Aromatic Ginger and Fruity Magnolia. I think there's actually one more that I gave to my boyfriend. I have a KKW, I don't know, it's like a citrus. I have a Chanel Chance and a Victoria's Secret Bombshell Seduction. I'm gonna go bring like face washes and deodorants and everything and set them out. I gathered the troops. What is this? I have a Kylie Skin Vanilla Milk Toner. Looks like that. Uh, oh yeah, I bought this. It's Victoria's Secret. This is a boyfriend's. Uh, oh, it's very sexy. What is it? I don't know. It's the boyfriend's perfume. I'll put it here too, so he can have a little moment to himself. I don't know, I'll figure it out. I have a Kylie Skin Foaming Face Wash, a Mario Badescu Facial Spray, Saravi Hydrating Facial Cleanser, a Tula Face Cleanser. So I'm just putting everything in and I'll organize it. St. Ives Hydrating Daily Cleanser Watermelon, a Biore Pore Unscrubber, a Acne Proofing Gel Cleanser from Neutrogena, Two sunscreens, I have a native sunscreen, I have not used this before, and I have a Neutrogena Invisible Daily Defense Face Serum with 60 SPF. The native is 30 SPF. The current deodorant I'm using is this native matcha and sweet cream, I love it. My backup is this cherry and vanilla macaron. Boyfriend's deodorant, this Gillette mask, a clay mask from Innisfree. This is from a Korean beauty store I got it. I love her. Speaking of, this is the high, um, this is the moisture I use. It's Soon Junk, I believe. And this is one of the only moisturizers that's ever worked on my skin. No matter what I do, no matter what I do, I've used tons of these Neutrogena ones. I've used Lancome Prairie. I've used high end. I've used low end. I've, I'm desperate for facial moisturizers and nothing seems to work on my peeling face, but this one works. I don't know how, but it does. Oil cleanser. What is this? It removes makeup. And I have a Suravi facial lotion. This one honestly leaves my face white, but I'm gonna put it here for now. I do also have like the Neutrogena. And I have these First Aid Beauty Facial Radiance Pads. I love these. And the Elf Restoring Spray. So let me figure this situation out. So my boyfriend has a couple of hair oils for his hair and braids and stuff. So there's so much space. So I'm going to just put it here. Actually, let me show you guys. There's a bunch of space still. So I'm going to go with these here as well. This is what it's looking like right now, but there's still so much empty space that that makes me very happy. I have my SPFs up front with my facial moisturizer, our deodorants, these are facial washes. Well, all these are facial washes. So yeah, this is what it's looking like. Bottom is sprays, shower gels, 
and lotions. And downstairs is miscellaneous. I decided to put in this little nook is I have these little wristbands so when you wash your face the water doesn't drip down your wrists and get all over the sink and your elbows and then I have a little thing that you put around your face I mean around your hair when you're washing your face and then I, I'm gonna also put these little face scrubs so this is like those little microfiber makeup removers and then this is a little exfoliating makeup thing. So I'm just gonna put this in this little nook. Yeah, I just found these under the sink. It's for Bath & Body Works men's sprays. What is it, deodorizing body sprays? Teakwood, Noor, Noor, Noor and Ocean. Uh, he doesn't really wear these, but I think if I put it up here and it's at, he might start wearing them more. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put them over here. I'm gonna pile all this together since I just laid it out because I had extra space. I'm gonna pile it all together and stuff it in here. You guys can join me down here. I'm gonna go ahead and really quickly organize this up and put, I have a bunch of Bath & Body Works soaps in here that I need to organize down here. By the way, guys, I did forget my tripod. Oh, I've just found another facial cleanser, which is why everything just looks, my angles are just crazy. Oh, I have to bring a vacuum and vacuum all his little hair. There are a bunch of hand sanitizers. Let me put the iron. Why is the iron under the sink? Who knows? Marshmallow Fireside. Fresh Mint Apple. Peach Prosecco Macaro. Blueberry Bellini. Coastal Watermelon, Vanilla Coconut, and Watermelon Lemonade. I just remembered that I want to put my makeup tray here. Makeup tray here, that's why I'm keeping all this empty. So let me go ahead and put this back here. And just for space purposes, let me do that. Hand sanitizers, I'll put back here. I have a bunch of hand sanitizers. I'm gonna put this big old baby oil down here too. Extra shampoo. A bunch of wallflowers. I think I'm gonna keep my wallflowers in here too. Four here, four more, two. I found a little mini cologne for him. I have to go put this in the little tray. So then, this is what it's looking like. That looks amazing. So then whenever I need to do my makeup, pull this out, do my makeup, and then put it back in here. I'll just like have it like here. I don't, it doesn't really matter. Just pull it out, put it back in. That way, because right now it's like in here, and it's very irritating having to like go through everything and trying to find everything. I'd rather be organized and I have so much space. That looks so much better. I don't really like that blue thing, but I'm gonna keep it now until the soap finishes and then probably toss it out. This is the new set I got. I got it from Bed Bath & Beyond. It's so cute, I love it. I actually thought this dish was gonna be bigger, but it's fine. This is, I think, so I could put like rings and jewelry whenever I'm washing up. I'll just put it here on the side. I was thinking about if I should put it in the middle, but I think I might have put it to the side so I could put jewelry down there. This is a little fake peony plant I got from Home Goods, and this is a little mouthwash. So yeah, this looks so much better. Down here looks like heaven. I'm so happy. The bathroom looks so much better now. All right, I just finished up this little organization kit. I didn't record the makeup aspect because this isn't like a makeup channel and I don't really care about makeup too much. I kept my lippies in here. I kept, or I put, this is a shadow armor and then this is mascaras, razors, and eyeliners. 
by the way uh i'll link this down below i got it from amazon if you guys are interested this is concealers primers foundation by the way i so i just purchased this from bed bath and beyond and it came freaking open or used so i don't know i'm not gonna return it because i don't have the receipt and ugh, it's just too much of a hassle i think i don't know if i should throw it away because i don't know if it's contaminated but for now i'm just putting it in here so i can remember to buy one so that's foundations concealers this is all the brushes i have this is masks down here face masks i put lashes here highlighter blush kit blush oh i just realized i don't have any bronzers all right i'm gonna have to bring some bronzers over and this is all my shadow kits my shadow palettes i should say they're beautiful i love my um i love the shadows and they fit perfectly here i'm happy with the amount i have here i do want to bring over more foundations i want to bring over more blushes and bronzers and more lippies but that's it so let me go and put everything in the bathroom including the cart this is everything i have decluttered from the bathroom this is all trash so it's good to get rid of all this stuff i'm back in the bathroom i'm kind of debating if i want to put it down here because it's kind of heavy or do i want to put it up here so i just emptied all this out this is where i was keeping all the stuff but i just wanted to make room for more towels and storage and i didn't want my body care to take up all my space so i can't decide if i want to put this under the sink or in there i feel like under the sink is better because we always keep this closed whereas this door does open so that way less dust and stuff yep that's i'm about to do that yep that's what i'm gonna do so every time I want to do my makeup, I'll just pull this out, do my makeup, put it back in. Okay. This is the little mirror I use. So let me go ahead and stuff this little mirror on the side. Put it down there. Now that all this also opened up because this is where I kept my makeup. So I think over here I'll put my hair stuff. And then, oh God. I don't know guys, it's a journey. I'm on an organization journey. Oh, let me go ahead and bring the cart. I'm not too happy with it being in this corner. I feel like it's kind of in the way. Like, let's say we're going in the bathroom. Um, yeah, so let's pretend. See, like, if I'm sitting on the toilet, I get to, like, look at everything and, you know, play around with all my stuff. So I feel like it's good. But I'm a little hesitant because this is where, you know, when you dry your hands, uh, what, I don't want water droplets. To s I wish. Now, this is what I wish. I wish these drawers weren't here and I could have just stuffed this in there. So yeah, this is the only corner I have to put it. Um, I'll see if my boyfriend comes home if he has any ideas. But now this is what it looks like. I love this. It is clean. I need to put toothpaste on my list. And then this is over here. And I have just opened up. Oh, and also this down here oh i'm so happy now i have opened up so much storage because now this is empty this is basically empty this is basically empty now i'm gonna stuff my towels in here that's empty that's empty like you got a lot of storage space i'm very happy with the work i did today Oh, I also need to buy a shower shelf so I could put all this stuff, all the goodies up on the wall. If you guys are interested in that video, let me know. I will go ahead and record that as well. That is my little storage cart organization. Let me know if you guys have any ideas. If you guys were me, would you guys change anything? Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!